Now, 23 3 and 0 uh, in the red corner for Zhang Weili. And then you've got 13 2 and 1 for Amanda Lemos in the blue corner. Now, this is China versus Brazil. And they're pretty much evenly matched in terms of body types. Highs is pretty even. But you're looking at a two inch advantage, only ever so slightly in the reach for someone like Lemos. Um, and that might matter, matter because someone like Lemos is predominantly going to be using her hands to get something like this yeah. one done. Um, if we go straight over to how this fight matches up in the grappling and significant strikes, we can probably draw up a narrative here, couldn't we? We mm -hmm. can look at the striking and we can say, uh, or, or even like the wins by, and we can say that, yeah, Lemos is the knockout striker, the knockout the, the knockout artist. No, she's mm -hmm. knocked out over 62% of her recent wins. And Wei Zhang's got less than 50% of her wins by via knockout. Mm -hmm. um, now, here's the thing. We saw Wei Zhang come out against JJ, and JJ's a brilliant striker. Wei Zhang... Uh, like beat her on the striking. Yeah, we saw her come out against um, Kyla Esparza, and Kyla Esparza is a brilliant submission artist. I mean, she's a great wrestler. We saw Wei Li Zhang out wrestle Kyla Esparza. Yeah. So now we've got Amanda Lemos, who's a great knockout artist. What is Wei Li Zhang going to do to her? I wonder. Yeah. No, so. you, yeah, you're spot on with that. You broke that down perfectly. And yeah, this this one's a tough one for me because Lemos is big, very very big for the division, and um. I'm not saying Wei Zhang isn't, but just when you see Lemos when she's up against her opponents, it's like whoa. And even like even when she was against Entourage, and Entourage managed to get the submission on her. But yeah, it, it's the leg kicks of Lemos that could pay dividends in this fight uh, and could path a way through to maybe getting a finish. But like yeah. you said, Wei Zhang has uh, she's improved so much on every era and every aspect of her game. And and like you said perfectly, there she's beating the strikers. At her own game, and then she's beating yeah. the grapplers and the, the wrestlers at their own game. Like, is that how is she going to come out in this one? Is she going to really stand and sort of outstrike Lemos? <laughs> no way. Wow, 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 wow. Look, it's anything can happen, right? And um, in terms of the um, striking abilities here, or, or, yep. or like the, the, the dangers here for Wei Li Zhang, where is she going to find it against someone like Lemos? Where is she going to see? Where's, where's Lemos going to be most dangerous in this fight? Because I think a lot of people will be going Wei Li Zhang based on... Yeah, a lot of people will. And like I said, I think the advantages that Lemos will have uh, will be in a stand-up, like we were just saying. And I think the leg kicks will pay dividends and they could mm. set, up, set up multiple uh, different attacks or even different looks that she, she could uh, impose. Yeah. Um, and maybe throw Wei Li off balance and then she could uh, potentially go for the grappling. Yeah. Who knows? Yeah. I think, I think Lemos needs to... I think she could just have surprise and power. Like if she's smart enough, she probably oh, she won't. Got power in the locker, yeah. Yeah, but I, I don't think she should come out exhibiting all that she can do. Mm. I think she needs to come out quite light, not too tough. And yeah. then when where these least expects it, that's when the power comes in and halfway through that first round, just whip something nasty on her entry. She, mm. I think catching Zhang by surprise might be one of the only ways to do it. And you might, you, you do tend to find that. You tend to find like yeah. these fights, which you would think, okay, Zhang has got this in every area. Um, it, how do you beat a person like that? Well, then it's, 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 exactly. it's, it's the art of war. When you're weakest, you got to seem strongest. When you're the strongest, you got to seem weakest. So mm. I think she needs to play, you know, not expose her power until until she's really going to sit down on it and uh, surprise yeah. Zhang on something nasty. But let's have a look Very at true. the uh, let's have a look at those gauges and see what this co-main looks like, uh, striking wise. These uh, Canadian makers in the house. Welcome yes, in, what's T. up, T? How are we? You Hope good? You're doing well, sir. Yes. Uh, Breezy says I haven't been recently. I'll admit, but I want to get back onto it. Is that joining the watch longs? Is it? Is that what you mean? Hey, guess what? Then three a.m. Though, yes, Ooh, it's an early one. Um, and obviously, Canadian maker was just touching upon. He's going for the Irishman. Obviously, in Gary in the last one we just broke down. Yeah, yeah, you know. Right. Why wouldn't you? Sorry, now we go. Why wouldn't you? He's got that star power, isn't he? He's the next Conor McGregor coming through. Well, if not Paddy, then mm. no Gary. That's um, true. So, striking. I think... Oh, this is Ooh. tough. It's tough. I'm going to put the power on um, Lemos nice and early. I feel that like Lemos is going to have the power advantage. Saying that, <laughs> watch Zay Wade Zang come and knock her out. Mm. <laughs> Do you know? Um, they I'm both gonna, got power as well, yeah. They they do, they do. But I guess when you look at how the fights are done, it is Lemos who relies on that more so than someone like yeah. Wei Li Zhang. Like she can crack, yeah. 
Let me look at the grappling. I would have to side with Wade Zhang on that one. The grappling one. Yes, I, I agree. Yep. I think that's going to be fully in her area. Um, Me, I'm going to have to go for Whaley as well. You would? Yeah, I could go. But then again, yeah. I, I just think she's quicker in all areas, if you get what I mean. Lemos, mm. her leg kicks are quick, but yeah, yeah, I just think Whaley's more athletic. True. Cardio now. I'll have to go Whaley again. Yeah, go Whaley because we've seen go five, yeah. Yeah. But then that leaves striking still up and out there. Who gets, mm. you know, could, I, I feel like when it comes to the striking, that's where Amanda's going to have her biggest advantage. Yeah, um, I, I mean, agree, not yeah. saying it's going to be a huge advantage, but that's mm. really where she's going to want to keep it. Grappling, she doesn't want that. Uh, and I, I think because of that, in this matchup, Weili Zhang might not stand and strike too much. Oh, I don't know. Yeah. It's hard to say. Mm. So would I, I would you go, good. would you go Lemos or would you go? Yeah, Zhang? we stick it with Lemos for now. Because like you said, she's got a um, higher finish rate, right? Yeah, she does. I mean, that's where the power comes in. Uh, mm, if we look at significant true. strikes landed, um, yeah, Wei has got 5.79. Where, where Signif- Wei Li utilizes her leg kicks. Mm. Because obviously we all know that um, Lemos has great striking with her hands, but then she has great kicks. Yeah. And if you're going to determine uh, what's going to be more effective, like a powerful leg kick or a tippy-tappy leg kick from Wei Li, you, you're going to go for Lemos, aren't you, with a, yeah. a powerful or more sort of deadlier strikes. I think you've pretty much put these numbers into words very well there because you've got landed per minute is slightly more for Wei Li Zhang. Um, she does edge the advantage in terms of output, but in terms of significant strikes, yeah, yeah. that's Amanda Lemos who does edge that as well. She's got 10% yeah. on top of uh, Wei Li Zhang's 47% point per percent. Mm-hmm. Um, so yeah, look, uh, you, you put it pretty well. I, I can side with that. I can get on board with that. I do think, again, agreeing with the gauges, it's the red corner who takes a win on this one. I think mm-hmm. it will be um, uh, Wei Li Zhang. I think where it matters, I think the, the things she does have there on the gauges is where it matters most in this fight. Yeah, I, I think if she if she can uh, come out and grapple with Lemos when she needs to and time an entry, I think she can keep Lemos down and potentially get a submission. Yeah, yeah. That's it. Well, that's not how the story goes, though, right? She outstrikes no, the striker. She submits mm-hmm. the submission artist, and she knocks out the knockout artist. I mean, <laughs> that's how she's she completes a little triple whammy. Surely, you imagine. Yeah, look, she's great. Um, nonetheless, she really is.